Good day guys, I'm yours truly, the original Spy Kitty, and once again we have... Fee! Hi guys, great to be here again! It's good to have you on today. Thank well, as you know, it's Tuesday, and on Tuesday we feature the best coming out, out of Asia. And as you know, this is a Trini reaction. Um, today we will be doing a South Korean horror. Mm -hmm. You like horror films? I love it. I love it, but sometimes I get too scared. You get scared? You don't like to sleep alone. Oh god, I'm a real sucker for a horror film. My best horror films are... what? The Exorcist and um, the what would you call it? The Conjuring Part One. Part Two was alright, but Part One, yeah. Exorcist was like Exorcist is really scary for me. But I remember when I was little, I saw the Gorgon. <laughs> 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 Actually, I was not supposed to see it, but yeah, I but she was peeking through, yeah. And I was peeking through, and I slept with my parents for a while. I sneaked in the bed. Yeah, yeah, I was yeah, really yeah, scared. Yeah. Real scary cat, real scary cat. I don't know why she yeah. watches them anyway. <laughs> yeah, but I do like, who doesn't like a good, good horror, horror film? film. Yeah, sure. You know, who doesn't like to be scared? No, I hate horror films that are cheesy. Yeah, so today what we'll yeah. be doing, we're going to check out a, a horror film from out of Asia, out of mm -hmm. South Korea to be exact. Now, mm -hmm. Asian cinema has real good horrors. There was um, Jung Won and there was Ringu, which is the remake to The Grudge and The Ring. Okay, you, you know, you know the grudge films from <clears throat> those or the originals of those films came out from Japan. It's Japanese horror, Juwon and Ringu. They are Japanese films. No one And it was remade in the they was remade they had the American version, which is the ring and I the grudge. see. Well yeah. okay, great. <clears throat> so we're gonna check out a film um, by um, one of the directors now, Hong Jing, and it's starring Kwak Dung Wong. The name of the film is The Wailing. It came out in 20... Why, why that expression? It came out in 2016. Um, I saw this film. It's, it's like the second South Korean film that I ever saw. Uh -huh. And I love it. Anyway, guys. So, we want to check out this film. Fiona hasn't seen it. So, she doesn't know what she's going to see. Alright, guys. So, you ready? Without further ado, let's just check out um, the trailer. Oh, by the way, it's two trailers. We're going to look at the first trailer and then the second trailer. Okay, great. But it's the same film, okay? Same film. Two okay, trailers. great. Great. Okay, so I don't know Will you have to see the film to know? I can't tell you what he saw. Guys, we're going to go straight into the second trailer and then we'll have our little discussion at the end. Uh, when I hear Fiona's view on this. I like that. I like the This one is a little more. It's 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 a
Yeah, it, 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 it's a little more um, detailed than it was still. What do you think? What Be honestly, what do you really think? Okay, so there is someone. Did that is that little girl? Is she possessed? Is this a demon possession show? Was that little girl possessed? What you love that body trailer? Uh, um, the music is dark. Yeah. The setting is dark. That's correct. They're whispering a lot. Yes. The cinematography is amazing. It is yes. very gloomy. Yes. When I saw it, what made me watch this film is the trailer, right? Mm -hmm. It was so dark. So gloomy, it's so really, on. Yeah, it's like unsettling. It sucks, it sucks you in because yeah. I'm like, yeah, it, it's unsettling and unnerving kind of uh, yes. um, a vibe that you're getting from the trailer. Um, is a phenomenal film. This director Na Hu Jing did two other films that I saw. One was The Chaser. The Chaser came out in twenty two um two thousand and eight, right? And it's a serial killer film, and it is what's nice, mind boggling. It will make your blood crawl. It's, it's graphic. It, he's a real talented director. He knows uh, his stuff, people. No, he's really, really talented. That that mm -hmm. film and that film won best picture yeah. and it also got um, um best director. Okay. And in terms of this film, this film have three characters in it. Mm -hmm. So if you're watching this film, there's three characters you have to pay attention to. There is a, a Japanese man because you know in the trailer they said all this started when a Japanese man came. Correct. Right. Yeah, yeah. So he's a key character in the in the in, in the um in the in, in the, the film. film. Uh -huh. And then there is a shaman. Yeah, he's a kind of like what you would call a local obia man. That's right. Ah. He's like a local obia siaman. Yeah, like Monaco and Hawks kind of thing. Yeah. Because he hit is it. Um, he hit an, uh, a vessel, a water vessel, and a bird came out of yeah, it. Yeah, and yeah, instantly I go like, ah, obia man. Yeah. Obia and and man. then there is and then there is the woman in white. Who is she? The woman that was speaking. Yes, to the woman. So it, she's it, real. Yeah, but it is a really good film. Uh -huh. It's not your typical horror. The jump scares. You're not going to get jump scares in this. What makes this scary is the situation. What makes this really intense is that that father and the desire to help his child because it first starts off as a murder mystery because people were dying and they don't know why yeah. and he's just your local average cop right so he's your every daughter. yeah and um, all of a sudden what people was experiencing started to, his daughter started to experience it okay. and being the investigating Cop, Officer. And he is still trying to find answers for his child. For his what child, is happening yeah. with his daughter? Yeah, it, it is a phenomenal film. So does great. he accept that, that it is a supernatural no, experience? No, well, it is, it's, it's, it's more than that. It, at the end of the film, you still wouldn't be sure what it is. What it is. That's what they do in South Korea. Sometimes they leave it out for open interpretation. What is, is like. It's dark. You hearing these people whispering. It's you are like. It brought you in. It brought me in. And yeah, it's a foreign well, film. Yeah, that, it's something totally different from what I would normally. It's watch. a fantastic trailer. At the end of it, this is a real fantastic trailer. Anybody sees this trailer, I think it would be interested in wanting to know what is the the story behind it. It's, it's great storytelling at its best. It's, so it's does great. the father get to see? I'm not going to tell you. You need to watch the Was film. Was she possessed? Ah, uh, you need to watch the film. Yes, it's not the demonic. Uh, it's not like the possession you will see in American films. I see. I will put. Let, let me put it like that. It's not your typical American um, thing. Demonic it's not that. Possession. Yeah. yeah, it's not film. what you are accustomed to. It's not that. I have one more question. Yeah. After I see this film, do I need to um like 
hug my cat and sleep at night or I don't think I don't think it's Do I have to call no. you up on your phone and go like No you're my you're my more quick Who was the Japanese man? Was he yeah, this? Was he you... that? Who was the shaman? Why he wo yeah. Somehow so, I feel I'm gonna like that character, you know, because he is like the o local Obia man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You understand? You understand people? So before we go any further, I just wanna read I and D B and see what it's all about. So Fina, you will read that for us? Definitely, yes I will. Soon after a stranger arrives in a little village, a mysterious sickness starts spreading. A policeman drawn into the incident is forced to solve the mystery in order to save his daughter. <laughs> That's right, baby. It is That's a mystery right, baby. to save yeah. his daughter. So it's a bit of investigative. Right. It's a bit of supernatural. Right. It's a bit of folklore. I love folklore. Yeah, so it, it's it's a great film. I strongly recommend you should check it out. So guys, that's our little thoughts on the whaling. You saw what's feeling a reaction and what's her thoughts are. Um, I'm your truly the original Spikey D. And I'm V. And I thank you all again for stopping by and for watching until the end. You guys are amazing. Keep subscribing and let us know if there's any other foreign films out of Asia or India that you might be familiar with that you want us to check out. Definitely, we will give our opinions. And wherever you are in the world, I hope you are safe. I hope that you are in good health. And I see you guys and you in the next one. Bye. Peace out.